I think a fair estimate would have been Wigan, biggest budget in the division, Sheffield United probably second. Are you going to be in that ballpark still next season, if, even if you are sort of oh, cutting back a little bit? Um, Rob, we were top of the league. Above Wigan? For player wage, but yeah. OK, now, is that relevant now? No, not really. Uh, will the player wage bill still see us top of the league next season? I suspect there or thereabouts. Will it be as high as this past season? I'd like to think not. But what we're really saying is the support's there for what's right, to rebuild the team, the squad, to bring success. And, you know, if, if for next season we weren't quite there, but we've seen vast improvements and we like what we see, and you can see a team developing to be ever stronger... I think as supporters we'd all be pleased. That in itself, is is that not more of a long-term approach than if you're saying, like, as long as we can see encouraging signs there, that we can see the club is moving forward, that promotion isn't necessarily the be-all and end-all next year? Um, yeah, I mean, I, we all obviously want promotion, mm. let more be any, any doubt about that. But this season that's gone by, at the end of it, you've not seen much evidence of the team getting stronger to be right and proper for promotion this coming season and that's one of the reasons behind deciding to make change. If it were to pass that the towards the end of next season we're seeing good football, we're seeing an intimidatory atmosphere at Bramber Lane that brings back spirit among supporters and players but we miss out for say but if improvements being the case we'd all be um, not quite content but accepting it's taking more time than we wish. <laughs>